Hey, what is up, Winjas? This is your girl, Maya, and I've put together a really fun flow for you. You gotta try it. It's gonna hit your lower back, your hamstrings, and those tight ass hips I keep on hearing about. <laughs> so I'm gonna show you what it looks like first, and then I'm gonna break it down. <laughs> this is what you're gonna learn today. Pay attention. Lower back, hip, more hip, more hip, lower back, hamstrings, hip, more hip, more hip, Woo! be excited, it's going down. Okay, so I love being able to move my body like that where I'm basically just putting flowing three movements together, but doing it seamlessly and with control and precision that you end up just creating this like amazing energy and synergy between all your muscle groups. Plus it feels freaking badass to be able to move like that, like a winja, I call it. So I'm gonna break it down for you. Make sure you have the mobility. Make sure you have the prerequisite mobility to do a lot of these. Go back to my previous mobility videos if this is too advanced for you. We're gonna start in the deep squat. Ass to grass, deep ape, whatever you wanna call it, get your ass down there. Boom. So even sitting like this alone, cranking that hip open, this is gonna give you that really nice hip opening mobility action. From here, you're gonna sit down on your butt with control. And then roll back onto your shoulders. So we call this the shoulder roll. When you're ready, bring your feet behind you, keeping yourself on your shoulder the entire time. So right now my butt squeezed, my quads are squeezed, my abs are squeezed tight. I'm totally engaged and present in my movement. Bringing it, folding it in half. Keeping the legs straight is gonna help you stretch out the hamstring. If you can, touch your toe behind you. And right here, you're gonna get this nice stretch in that lower back muscle that a lot of us are tight in. <sighs> so this is called the shoulder plow. It's a common yoga pose, and it feels freaking good. So I'm gonna give it a little something something by actually <laughs> changing the position of my feet. Oh, and that's just gonna help me stretch out all the other areas of my back as well. So. Give yourself a few rotations here. Use your fingertips to help control yourself. Ah, feels good. When you're ready, you're gonna slowly roll back into a seated position, into a squatted position. So I'm gonna visualize my spine here, rolling me up. <laughs> Winja! <laughs> Get yourself back up into a nice deep squat. That might take a few tries to do it so seamlessly. Once you're here, you're gonna internally rotate one leg at a time. So drop the knee, back into a deep squat, drop the other knee. Boom, and repeat. Up, use those elbows to help get your leg up. Contract your legs, get those toes points to the ceiling, squeeze those quads, squeeze that butt, belly into the spine, and then slowly bring the toes down. Enjoy this for a moment, and then do your rainbows. It would look like little rainbows that you're drawing with your toes. And then here we go. One more time. It's just so fun to move like this, guys. And behind. So no need to rush through that, all right? Break down each thing one at a time before you put it together and do something amazing. <laughs> focus on each individual part by themselves. So focus on your deep squat and then focus on the roll back onto the shoulder and then focus on the little foot sweep before you put it all together. And damn, you're gonna feel amazing. It's gonna get your heart rate up. 
I'm sweating. Plus your body's gonna be like, yo, I am ready for action. You could do that before a workout. You could do that after. You can use that as a warm up. You can use that as a nice like mobility day drill. Oh, anywhere you want, throw that in and you're gonna feel 110% better, ready to seize the day. So I hope you guys enjoy little flows like that. I really love exploring movement and putting things like that together because it's way more fun for me. If you guys find this helpful, please give me a thumbs up, share it with your friends that are tight in their back, hip, spine, hamstrings, and subscribe. I'm here every Wednesday dropping new content. And you can also find me on Instagram, Facebook. I'm on all the socials under Move With Maya, M-Y-A and I post daily on Instagram. I'll see you guys next time.